Hey guys, I'm back today and I have no makeup on right now because I'm going to be doing a chatty like get ready with me video and I love that idea. I've done get ready with me videos but typically I'm just like talking about what I'm putting on my face and it's just so boring. I feel like this is a really great way for us to catch up and you guys know I love to just like, I don't know, I feel like when I get on, when I start talking on video, I just don't shut up and like my vlogs can be forever. But I thought this be really fun and um, yeah, so I'm really busy today. But I do want to do, to do one thing, and I kind of want to bring you guys with me. We'll see how like this goes. I really want a freaking ivy plant so bad for my place. And I was inspired by... I have it pulled up on my Instagram, I think. I hope I do. No, I thought I did, but I didn't. It's called Atlantis Home. Um, and she has like ivy plants just hanging like in between doorways. She has ivy plants everywhere. And I just love her style. It's not exactly what I like. It's a little bit like kind of crazy. But I'm just, I don't know, I've been getting a lot of inspiration from this account lately um, in like a more toned down version, I'd say. So I've been looking for an ivy plant for like weeks and I can't find one. Like all, I went to like this nursery three times. They keep telling me they don't order it in. And every time I go back, they don't order it in. And they look at me like I'm like crazy. Like, I don't know, it's just, I don't know. Just, I'm, whatever. I can't get, I can't, won't go into it, but I can't find an ivy plant. And I really want one. So maybe we can go today. I'll bring you guys to the nursery with me because I really, really want one so bad. And I want to put, I've been dying to put it in my place. Um, so yeah, the next thing is what I'm wearing. I'm wearing this, um, just vintage U.S. Army jacket and I really like it. It's really soft. Um, and I've been, I wear it like buttoned up. I wear it like over things. I just, I like it. I like the color. I like, and I like to wear it with like a nice outfit and then throw this over. I feel like it's very, uh, I like the, like the edgy look with like the soft look and the nice look with the casual look and things like that. Um, and then my, you guys know I'm really into showing off like the top of my bra. I don't mind like the top of my bra is showing because I have like a smaller chest so I don't mind if like it opens a little bit because nothing's going to show. Man, right? It's just like a flat chest. So anyway, I recently got a subscription box from Adore Me. I'm sure a lot of you guys have heard about them already. And I've always been like, hmm, what is this? So I ordered a few things. And the first set was only $24.95. And you got free underwear too. And I figured, okay, like whatever about the free underwear. But I do have to tell you guys, I was really, really, really surprised by the quality. Especially for $24.95 for the first set. Like how nice it really is. I've been wearing this bra for over a week now, and like, is that bad? Like, I don't wash my bras that often. Is that disgusting? Oh my god, it probably is. Like, okay, that's gross. Um, but I like, I, I really like it. It's a demi bra. I love demi cups, and it has little like polka dots on it. And I was just like, really too much to show you guys. I don't know, but it's so cute. Definitely, like. I don't really buy bras from Victoria's Secret and stuff because they're really expensive and they never fit right. So I just wear like cheaper bras but this one feels really nice and I love it and I'm really gonna go and tell you guys about the underwear because I was so surprised I figured it would just be like whatever underwear but these are the most comfortable nice most ni nicest underwear I've honestly worn in a very long time and I want to go back and just order these like as well I think I want this bra too I want it in black because it's really nice um, but I was so surprised by how nice the underwear is the quality and the material and the fact that there's no seams on it, so it really feels like just your skin. Anyway, I was really surprised and happy with my order from there. So, you definitely check it out. Um, I don't know, I really like it a lot. I love this one. It's really soft, too. Uh, okay, next is my, my uh, next are my new chokers. This is like what I'm doing this week. I have a huge, a whole new line coming out of these really sporty chokers that have like plastic like clear plastic weaving in the middle and they're like stretch but they're the closure in the back is a really nice closure with an hrh tag and a clasp it's not just like a headband or whatever you know it looks like it but it's really really gorgeous i have a ton of stuff coming out so definitely go check it out when i go out today i might wear something different um so you guys can see i want to show you everything i feel okay i'm just going to show you a couple things um, because I just am really, really excited to show you. Okay, we're going to start out with these. These are called my ballerina ties, and I have them in black, um, a light, like, mint green, and then a really light, almost, like, blush nude color. And here they are, and I showed them yesterday, and everyone was, like, so excited about them, and everyone's, you know, asking when it's time to order. And today's the day, um... 
as usual, the first round of these are going to be limited and then I'll be able to get more in. But um, it's also taking me, so I've hand sewed all of these and um, they're just really, really, really nice. Which one should I choose? I'll just choose, oh, I'm just so in love. Okay, hold on. This is the nude one. This is the green one. And then the black one. And they're all velvet. I'll just do the nude one because I just, oh my God, I love this. This is like, I think this is my favorite one. Okay, so the nude one, they're all, I told you, hand sewn. Really, really nice. And the, it's like a stretchy velvet. So it's really soft, it's not stiff, it falls, it's beautiful. It's really, really nice quality. And um, so anyway, you can wear it like this and then you can tie it in the back or you can tie it around again and put a bow. You can also wear them as bracelets. And like this, and like this, and then tie a little bow at the bottom. It's, they're just really, really, really gorgeous pieces. And the baguettes in them are really, really, really sparkly and the little uh, regular round diamonds are, part, are beautiful too, but I just love the baguettes. So these are being launched today. Don't be afraid to uh, layer things. You'll see how I've done it in pictures. I have a lot of um, really, really beautiful lace pieces coming out. It's so pretty. This layered with one of these. It's just so romantic. These are coming in sets of two. Um, so like I have a nude set, black set, a denim set, and a white set. So I'll kind of just show you guys the nude set because that's the one I like. I really love the nude because I'm very into like, this is coming up very orange right here, but in real life, it's more of like that really in brown nude color. I feel like it's very Kylie, you know what I mean? This color is very her. And um, anyway, I'm also having so like my sporty ones and this is, okay, I wanna show you guys the white one because I'm really into this right now. I'm gonna show it to you on my, can you see it here? I feel like, okay, I know this is like so, I'm like being Kardashian, right? This is very like Kim K, I feel like, this around your neck. It's this really cool fiber. I just love it so much. Can you imagine that around your neck? It just looks so cool. You can't tell here, but you can really tell in person. Anyway, I could go on and on about this stuff. Please go check out all my new things. I also have my new sparkle lariats up for you guys to order. And yes, a lot of new things and I'm so excited. Go check it out. Okay, let's get ready. I'm gonna start getting ready. You guys, I'm gonna talk forever though. So I'm gonna show you guys what I've been doing. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you that too. So I'm just gonna put on some, I already put on some moisturizer, but now I'm gonna put on a little bit of like base. And I'm when I get ready in the morning, I seriously just, um, I just don't, I don't do like a really thorough job. I just do it like kind of quick job and that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, also with my eyes, I've been doing something totally different. I feel like I have been doing what I used to do in high school. And I don't, I usually, when I do this, I do it when winter comes around because it's more of like a dark eye look, but I love it. And it's looking like, I don't know, I feel like very on when I'm wearing it. I just really like it. Okay, so I'm gonna do this first. I'm gonna use my cushion, and this is from my friend Grace in Singapore, and it's this, I can't pronounce it. Okay, you guys, you can pronounce it, and I got it in the number 13, or she got it for me, in the number 13, it's called Light Pink, and the color works perfect for me. I don't know how in the hell she even knew my color. Like, it's right on the money, though. It's like, looks so good. So I'm just gonna pat, 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 and then actually, so, I actually should tell you guys some things, right? Like, I feel like we need to catch up about my life. And I wanna tell you that I've been very, so remember my last vlog, how I was like so down on myself because I was sort of like getting fat and everything? Well, I have gotten to the point in my life, again, where I have, I like, I'm like, that's it, enough is enough. And I feel like for the past over a week, I've been so good, but I haven't even been trying. That's how I am, I, if I, if, like I can't diet or be healthy or whatever until I reach that point where I'm like, that's it. Because if I try, I'm gonna like cheat. I'm not gonna really wanna do it. I'm gonna make excuses like I do a cheat day or whatever. But for real, like I've hit that point where like nothing made, I didn't feel good in anything. Nothing I did made me feel good. So I have totally changed my lifestyle. Oh my God, I love this. Doesn't that look like perfect? I've totally changed my lifestyle. I'm just gonna tell you guys some things when I'm doing my makeup. Like, a lot of people ask me, like, how did you lose your weight in the very beginning? Because you guys know I got up to like 181 pounds at one time. You have to, like, 
just know for yourself. You have to just like, it, it, it's, a, it's a switch. I feel like it's a, a switch that flips in your head and that's what's happened this time. Like, I don't even have to try. Like, I don't even have to, like, I don't even think about cheating anymore. Like, I don't because I'm done. Um, for example, like every Wednesday night, Nick and I go forever. We've gone to the same Mexican restaurant because we just love it. They have the best chips ever. They're like those super salty, thick, greasy ones. And the salsa is just like to die for. I literally every, for four or five years since I've known him, um, I will never skimp on those chips. Like I will indulge in that entire basket and like not feel bad about it. I'd be like sick to death the next morning of like too much salt and I wouldn't even care. Um... I've, we've went, it's been two weeks now since I've been being good. I, we went, to, for example, last night, I didn't even have one chip. The basket of chips sat in front of me, I didn't even have one chip. Like, that's how done I am with, like, my weight right now. And so, I mean, it's not even like I've gained a ton of weight, but I seriously think it's over 10 pounds. Like, I refuse to get on the scale because I just don't, I'll kill myself. I feel like I'll kill myself. Um, I shouldn't have done that. I'm just right. I don't know. Why did I just put powder? I hate powder. Anyway, so I just want to tell you guys that I have noticed, like, I'm not noticing, like, a drastic weight loss change, but I've noticed that I am, like, slimmer, and I don't know, like, I'm, like, just done with it, and I've just reached that point, point. and so I think a lot of you guys will agree with me, like, you have to get to that realization, you have to get, have enough, you have to have, like, right now I've had enough. Oh, you guys probably saw my last video, I was, like, so miserable, right? Like, that's one of the reasons, like, I, I just, whatever. Is what it is. Okay, here's my new. <laughs> okay, here's my new eye look. Here we go. It's just black. I black out all of my rims, like the top rim, bottom, everything. Just loving this look. But when I do it, I do like several passovers. And then another thing I do is before I go to sleep, is this disgusting? It probably is. I also rim the top of my, I do that to both eyes and then I go to sleep when it's the next morning. I wake up and I have like a very cloudy looking black eye and it's very pretty. And even if I wash, when I wash my face in the morning, I still have some black and just very, it's like so 90s dead girl. Like I just really love it. I feel like it makes my eyes pop too, right? Also, okay, hold on, I can't see this. Also, my nails, I kind of like made a mistake. Like this color didn't look like as orange as it does in person when I was at the nail salon. And I'm so embarrassed because I went into, I think I went into work or something and my assistant was like, oh my gosh, like very festive for Halloween. And I'm like, oh my goodness, like I cannot stand festive stuff. I cannot believe that I people think I like am wearing orange for Halloween for like freaking jack-o'-lantern. I I think I have to get it changed because this is like not okay. Like this is I'm not trying to be festive. Like I'm, I don't like festive stuff really. Like I have to keep it to the minimum with festive things because I feel like it's so cheesy. Okay, um, that's that. Like, don't we love this? I just freaking love it. Okay, I love it so much. Then I'm gonna contour my nose because. I hate the way how fat my nose is. It looks like okay from the side, but like from the front, it's definitely not okay. And I know everyone's like, oh my god, what the hell are you doing? You only contour like one side of your your face. Like, yeah, it's true. I do only cont contour one side because I have a huge fucking bump right here. This whole thing is a bump. So I can't, like, if I draw that line, the, the it catches on the bump. So you just can't do it. I'm just like trying to like, <laughs> convince you guys. Okay. And I put like a little circle there. I know you guys should make this fucking crazy, but it looks good when I'm done. I promise. I'm not gonna lie though, I feel like for as good as I'm being with like my diet, I feel like I should be like 12 pounds now. I'm not starving myself. I'm not like starving. I'm just, I just feel like. I feel like it's so easy to get fat and it's so, um, this is Tom Ford, and it's so hard to lose weight. Like, ugh, 
even though it's not actually like I told you guys it's not hard anymore because I've reached that point so I starting to feel like it's hard probably should have done this at the end but I'm talking so I'm just like is that I gotta do my eyebrows now eyebrows are always such a hit or miss with me it's like ugh, it is, I don't even sometimes I don't even want to do them because it's like is it even gonna turn out good probably not so you might as well just not even do it I'm using my Anastasia and I'm using a brush um hopefully it turns out good okay you guys cross your fingers for me please because I hate like when it doesn't turn out good You know what I've been doing too as like a trick because I think my problem is like I don't eat you guys know I'm not like a big day eater but then when I get home I'm hungry so I probably have like a way too big of a like a dinner and then I also snack after even if I'm like not hungry after dinner I still will have something else to eat isn't that like sickening it's true so um I've been actually like making myself like a drink is that bad Oh my god, full of great advice, huh? Hold on. Like, I'm like not loving this, but my eyebrows are different. Like, what am I supposed to do? I've been making myself like a drink. Like, like um, I made myself like an apple cider kind of like drink with some vodka in it. And like, I don't know, I just like sip on that and like watch like a movie. And then, you know, that's it. I'm not having like 40 drinks. I'm just having like one drink and I don't do every night. But I just think it's like better than just going around and like snacking, right? You gotta do what you gotta do. I'm gonna use some of this. Shantike. Or Shantikai. God, I suck at saying things. I just love my eyes like this. Okay, can we please do the eyelashes now? I need a new eye I need a mascara so bad. I wanted to get that G1 she one. I got the Givenchy one, but I got the wrong one. I got the waterproof, so I gotta take it back and get the non. This is the um, the Chanel, which I do like as well. The sample of the Chanel, the um, volume one. I had this one before, but I think I like the Givenchy better. We love it. I just love it. I don't know what I love about this. I just feel like it really makes my eyes like super pop, but my eyes like don't aren't like like small and aren't anything, but I just feel like it even makes them even look like better. I'm gonna do a little bit of blush and I'm gonna use this one by Face Stockholm and it's in I got it from it's called Blush on Organza. I got it from Anthro. And I you know guys know I love everything Swedish. I'm not like so in love with this and I but it's fine, like whatever. Okay. Then I'm gonna show you guys my lips. So you guys know that I told you I'm missing, like my entire lip is gone here, the line or the color, because whenever I get cold sores, that's where it comes up every time, like for in my entire life, like I've never gotten a cold sore anywhere else other than there. It's not fucking so weird. Anyway, I um, am aligning this now. This is Kevin O'Quan in medium. See how that's white? Isn't that sad?
I have a lip now, my goodness. Okay, that's that. Um, did it go away a little bit? I feel like any more. I don't want to look like I'm wearing lipstick. It's so disgusting. Like, ew. Ugh, I hate lipstick. Like, during the day, especially. Like, so tacky. There's like this fucking bird outside He's doing like nose dive. He's probably trying to like eat a mouse or something. Okay. Um, what else? What else? You guys, I think we're done. Like, this is like what I'm going to do. This is like. Do we love it? Just simple, but I love the black. Try it. It's so much fun. And then, um, like, when you wake up in the morning, it's very, like, sexy. You know what I mean? Because, like, it's a little bit, you have, like, it's not, like, gross black or, like, gross, like, black in here. It's just very subtle for me. Like, I wake up in the morning and, like, have, like, very smoky eye. Like, a natural smoky eye. It's the best. Um, also, at night, um, I take my Becca. This I love this palette so much. My Becca um, Ombre Nudes. And I use this either this one or this one and I put it underneath my eyes just underneath and it like looks so dead girl so fucking cool I love it okay I'm gonna change now and should we I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna wear I'm trying to think like what I should wear like am I just gonna be like typical Alex or am I like I don't know I told you guys I don't have any fucking clothes anymore like I just don't like anything anymore um okay so yeah let me check Can we die over this? Like, can we die over this right now? Ugh, I just feel like, I feel so like ridiculous, like fierce and on in this. Such a must. So all of the lace ones, you guys can do this with the ballerina ties and they all layer. So it's just really cool. If you get a lariat from me, um, you know, like the one, the choker version, the sparkle lariat or the sleek dash lariat, you can wear it underneath the lace and just have your lariat like hanging down. It's Perfect. Okay, like I've designed it all to like work so well and tie this and then the scalloped edges I put towards the bottom. So if you wear the lariat, it's like it's just so pretty coming out of the bottom or you can turn it upside down and this is a flat edge. Okay. It just depends whatever you can wear. Everyone. But oh my God, like just like this, like I just feel so cool. You can't even feel it on your neck. It's really soft. So also, you guys know that I got um, my extensions back in, so I feel like really on too. And I'm gonna be talking about them more at a certain point, but my friend Meredith at um, Maven Salon, she told me about these kind of ex extensions and she told me like I needed these kind of extensions, like they're like, you know, whatever. They were so good and they're like, cause I, she knew how like, my other extensions didn't blend at all, right? It was like, remember how, it was like that, like so obvious, and it was really hard for me to blend them. Anyway, so she put these extensions in for me and they legit look like my hair, right? Like you can't see where my hair and the extensions end and begin. I mean, maybe at some point you can, but it's, their extensions, but you know what I mean, obviously, but they're so much better. I'm trying to brush it out because I slept in it. Yeah. But look at like how great that looks. I mean, it just looks like my real hair. Doesn't it look like this is like my real hair? I haven't really done anything to it anyway. I wasn't planning on really talking about it right now. So it's not like perfect, but just so you guys know, like my hair, she did it. So I want you guys to know that if you're looking for extensions or color, go look at her Instagram too. She does amazing transformations. But if you would have seen the janky ass hair that she took out of my head, it was like a rat's nest. We were like all dying. It was so embarrassing. But I'm like so excited. I just like, I just feel like me again. Like I just, I just love my long hair with like my eyes like this. I just feel like it. Oh, another thing. Did I run out of that? Where'd it go? I got a sample from Barney's of this replica. Where is it? Here it is. Of this um, replica perfume, which I really love. I think I want to go buy it. 
um, it's called, okay, it's called lipstick. So it actually smells like lipstick, which sounds ridiculous, but I love it. I fucking love it. Okay, it's by a uh, replica. How much are these? Are these really expensive? I'm like done with it. I think I might get it. Okay, guys. Oh, this lighting looks so good, right? Um, I'm gonna go to the nursery and um, then I'm, I feel like I wanna get coffee, but if I take too long out, then I won't be able to get this up in time. I don't know, it's always like, I'm the kind of person I always film and I upload. I don't do like, uh, I don't I, I don't like that. When people like film four videos in a day and then just like schedule them out, like, I don't know. I like to just like, like this is what I did today, you know what I mean? Um, so yeah, oh my God, I just like love this lighting. I'm all about this lighting right now. I'm wearing the same little jacket I showed you guys, and then I'm wearing these like mesh cutout pants. Those are Louis Vuitton sneakers. This is just a black top from Aritzia. And then I'm wearing that like mesh one that also comes in white. It's like, um, like a mesh thick netting. And it's not gonna snap, it's not gonna break. It's like really nice quality, don't worry about that. I love the white one too, but I feel like the black looks very cool with all the black. I, I wanted to, I should've worn the white, but I don't know, it's very like, modern ballerina it's just different i have a leather ones you know and everything i feel like this like new like mesh is so freaking cool um so yeah that's my look and oh god you guys this freaking ring is so annoying like i there's like always hair stuck in it it's like disgusting so that's kind of like the look so i just got my pumpkin spice latte and actually i really like it it's actually really good i'm not complaining can you guys fucking believe it like um i just asked for it to be a little bit less sweet than normal and it's really really nice i really like it it's very like for the season um So now I'm on my way to go to get the plant. Um, and in all honesty, like plant, um, and in all honesty, like I don't expect them to have it because this woman who orders the plants at this place is so incredibly rude. Like seriously, someone like, I don't know what her problem is. She's got like the worst attitude, mean problem ever. Like I, I, I honestly don't know what, like why me going in and asking like, if they have a certain plant is like cause for someone to be so rude, like mean and nasty. But I asked her, I was like, okay, I was like, hi, I was in here a couple weeks ago and you did, um, there was no IV. And first of all, she corrected me on that. She's like, we have IV, it's right there. And I was like, I was like, oh, well maybe it's not IV that I want. It's, and I went and pointed to like the one, there was like a dead plant of the one I wanted. And she's like, well, that's not Ivy. And I was like, okay, well, I said, I, I don't know the proper name. Sorry, this, I want this plant. Like, she was like all pissed that I didn't know the fucking name of the plant. Like, get over it. And then um, I was like, okay, well, I said, they told me last week that there would, someone would be, and you know when they'll be in then. And then she's like, um, she's like, well, we ordered them, but it just depends on like what they have that, there that day. I was like, oh, all right. So you don't really like, that sort of really is no like, so we don't really know. She's like, no, we don't know. We're not sure. Like, if we get in, we get in. If we don't, we don't. But, like, just like that. Like, really, bitch? Like, calm the fuck down. I'm just asking you if we're going to get this fucking plant in. God. Seriously. Like, I... S okay, you guys. I'm here at the nursery. Let's go. Oh, my God. It's so fun, right? I just really want that plant. Okay. Bing, sit. Oh, the truck's here. So, hopefully, they have... God, it was everything so hard. Ming, I should have just left you home. You're like, honestly not. This is like kind of what I want, but I want to be alone. Do you guys have these, like, are they, do they have a long one? Just up there. Can I open some up to see? Or? Um, it, yeah. is that the one that struggles? <laughs> I need to, um, <laughs> 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 Hi
get in trouble again. Sorry, would you mind telling me how much I'm supposed to water this and stuff? Uh, you water as needed. So it's like if, if your place is warm, it'll dry out faster. Just feel it? Just and check it, it, it like weekly. Yeah, stick it okay. in there. All right. And is it sun or no sun? No, no sun. Right? Okay. Thank you. Come on, man. Let's go. Always makes me feel so stupid. Like I know it's a fucking house plant. Okay, I just didn't know if it's supposed to be in the sun in the house. Like there are windows in houses, so there is likely going to be some sunny areas in your house. Fuck is everyone's problem. Okay, can you guys? Can we, do we love this plant? Okay, well, the ones that I saw were like, so much longer. This thing better grow fast because I'm not going to want some like bushy ass plant. In my house. I want it to be like long, like princessy. Come on, man, you're being annoying. <sighs> Never bring me in. Ming has like started to control my life because I'm like too nice to her. Cookie. Never mind, she's been good now. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna my trunk. Ming, be nice. probably get one of those like screws that go into like a roof right like a like a hook screw or something what's it called like it looks like a hook how am I gonna hang this thing up what the fuck was I thinking my goodness hey is the handyman coming tonight to finish everything is the handyman coming tonight to finish that stuff Okay, tell him we need, I want to hang a house plant in the house, so I need a hook. You know, one of those hooks that you put in the ceiling and it's like a, a hook, right? You know what that is? Will you tell him that? I want to oh, make sure it's white though, so it's not ugly. Yeah, I bought a plant and I want to hang, it's like a hanging plant. Alright, thanks. What's that? Hold me. What's that? 